let us unravel the problem of long division, division of polynomials. Okay, we have the polynomial here, we have the divisor. So how can we divide this and get the quotient without stress? What you will do is this. First, arrange it this way. Whereby, here is the dividend, here is the divisor, whatever that is here is the quotient, which is the answer. Then down here is the remainder. So let's see. The dividend, which is the polynomial, is 2x raised to the power 3 plus 3x squared minus x minus 4. Okay? Then x squared minus 2x plus 1. Now, for those writing jam, you don't need to strum this to the end. When you look at the options, you have 11x plus 2, 2x plus 7, 11x minus 11, x squared minus 2x plus 1. What will you do? Come over here, divide 2x cubed by x squared. Whatever you get, you write it down. So 2x cubed divided by x squared will give us 2x. Locate these options here. Anyone with 2x gives us the answer. As you can see, I suspect that this should be the answer. 2x starts it. So 2x, 2x. None has 2x. So option B is the answer. Then for those writing y -ek, let's see how we can divide this down so that you'll be able to understand how this solution was obtained. Now, 2x, you multiply it by everything here. 2x times x squared becomes 2x cubed. 2x times minus 2x will be minus 4x squared. 2x times 1, we have plus 2x. So that we add minus to this. So minus 2x squared, s cubed, minus 2s cubed, 2s cubed, minus 2s cubed will give us 0. Minus times minus is plus. So 3 plus 4 will give us 7. S Here we have squared. 7s squared. How? 4s squared plus 3s squared will give us 7s squared. How do I get it? Minus times minus is plus. So minus times plus is minus. Minus x minus 7, uh, 2x will give us minus 3x. Then this is minus 4. The next is, you divide this 7x squared by x squared. We have plus 7. 7 times x squared, we have 7x squared. 7 times minus 2x, we have minus 14x, 7 times 1, plus 7. We also have minus sign here, and as such, you see, this gives us 0, minus times minus is uh, plus, 14 minus 3 is 11x, okay, then minus times minus, minus times plus is minus, so minus 7 minus 4 is minus 11, so this gives us the remainder, as this is the quotient, okay? Then this is the divisor, divisor D. Here is the polynomial P of X, which is also called the dividend. So in the option, they didn't ask us to look for the remainder. Hence, we would have chose, chosen C. But they said find the quotient Q, which is 2X plus 7. 